sexy and I know it. And we're back. So again, uh, this is a voiceover. And second, I didn't figure out how to capture the uh, wolves and other animals till after I record this episode and the next one. So hopefully in the fourth one, I would have found where to craft the things that are necessary to capture them to capture them. Yay. And yes, you heard me right. I've already had the third one record because this and the third one were actually one video that was over an hour long. I managed to shave it down to like 40 something minutes, 41 minutes, and then I shaved it in half for two episodes. I got so excited when I saw this nest in my inventory. Like a stupid amount of excited. But you know, it's really funny because when the egg hatches, I, n I never actually found out that it actually hatched into a pet. I thought it just disappeared like everything else disappeared after I had it. So, yeah. It took so long for me to find out what it hatched into. But I eventually did. And uh, I'll equip it later on. I'm using my body as an umbrella. So I originally thought that the 10,000 right next to the percentage was the number that it would have to reach before it hatched. I, I swear I'm not an idiot for thinking this. <laughs> Trying to entertain myself while this thing is hatching. So to explain what I'm trying to do here is my original thought was to try to put a wall and then a roof on top so I can shield it from the rain because it looks to be affecting my, my character's temperature because it went down 10 degrees. I'm going to assume that's Celsius. That's really annoying because 10 and 20 is really cold in Fahrenheit. And eggs need heat, so obviously logic cover it from the rain and myself from the rain and, and yeah, logic. Yeah, it didn't work. I, I just gave up. This is also when I found out that the egg had disappeared. But obviously it didn't disappear, it just hatched. This is me looking for the egg. Oh, we're entering Candyland now, people. Decided to speed this up because it's really boring to watch me put shit in a chest. Thank you.
All right, so this is where I got really curious and it's really funny. So just watch this, this is so stupid. <sighs> To those who watched Madagascar 2, that's what this moods, idle, and walk animation is reminding me of when Alex was coming out to fight Teensy. <sighs> Why is that playful's idol? I was kind of hoping Mad would just be him growling. So I'm attempting this quest and I was going towards the farthest one. I'm glad I didn't get far before I noticed the closer one. I thought these were actual players. Looking for the dismount button. Ah uh, yes, it's totally not where it says dismount. Why do I have a horse if I'm not going to use it? So after this, I stopped attempting to do this quest because I don't know where the hell to find those. You know what? Fuck it. I don't care. I mean, I can get back to exploring the game if I, as I want to explore it because I don't have to do the quest if I can't figure out how to do it. So there we go. It all works out in the end. Did my horse just kill the wolf? This is one of my many attempts to find the mustard crossbow that you use to capture them. One of. I cut a lot of the attempts out. Don't worry. I really like how it actually shows what you're wearing. I live to see the level ups. This is where I chose genocide against refugees. It 
it was very clear that this person could not do anything against me. Killing is one of my favorite things to do in this game. No joke, I thought I was on fire here. What the? Did that tree just fall? Okay. What the hell is this? Gimme. To put short, I am what you call a looter. I love to loot. Who the hell's knocking down all the trees? They just chopped down another one! Bruh! Oh! Oh my god, I'm not alone! There's another player! A new friend! What are you doing at my house? Hi, friend! Oh my god, that's cool, I want one. They can't loot my chest, can they? Hello. Ah, yes, the universal friend language of squatting. Where are you going? What's that? Another player. Is he shooting at her? Bruh. Can you kill people in this? Oh, they're almost dead like I am. <laughs> Don't worry, my new friend. I will fight them off. This is the part where I figured that you cannot hurt each other, and I just left because it was wasting my time and my energy. What a douchebag though, right? Investigation mode activated. Screw investigation and kill mode activated. <laughs> Once again, we do not like riding our mounts in this game. I killed it so fast that it's stuck standing.
Okay, I'll admit it. The reason I'm not riding the mounts is because I love the running so much. this I'm not sure what I'm doing. I think I'm just going off to explore a little bit. Except the fact that my horse is a badass and will kill shit for me. <laughs> I'm not sure what I expected when I clicked that. My friend is back. Do they know I'm low health or are they just doing that just to do it because I'm doing it? They left me. Oh yay, I actually get to show you guys what came out of the egg. Because I didn't know something came out of the egg, because I'm a fucking idiot. Imagine putting a unicorn on this poor thing. I'm not gonna lie, I love that idle animation. What? It's really cute. I feel so bad for my character, he just kind of walks around like, why aren't you healing me?
One of the first things I've noticed when riding this guy is that he doesn't actually have a sprint button like the horse does. He's just kind of always going full speed. This is a very quaint looking house. 8 out of 10. It doesn't have a roof. Alright, time to judge this one. 3 out of 10. No walls. 6 out of 10. It's nice organization and nice flooring, but there's no walls and there's no roof. Oh wait, this is my house. Alright, guess there's no time like the present than to fix it up a little bit. You know, if I had enough materials. Guys, this is serious. We have another chance at a pet bunny. All right, we have to take it. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. <laughs> well, never mind then. Leave me alone! My character just looks so exhausted. So next episode, we have some exciting news for you guys. First of all, my house will be getting a makeover. Second of all, I will finally learn how to heal. So, yeah.